the non-invasive glucose monitoring device by Elliot, Brian and Carlos. Three young engineers decided one day for their senior design project that they wanted to contribute to their community in any way possible. After exploring the medical field, all three agreed that the battle against diabetes is a never-ending one. The task at hand was to develop a proper yet efficient system that would allow any diabetic or no diabetic at all to measure the blood glucose levels without the pain associated with it. As we can appreciate in the animation provided by our friends at NSF, traditional testing methods require multiple steps to follow without mentioning the amount of equipment that a person has to carry around on an everyday basis. Poking needles, disinfecting wipes, bandages, a little pouch to carry all those things plus the hassle of having to be exchanging fingers every time you get tested to avoid bruising your own fingers. Not to mention the blood. Oh man, the blood. There are hundreds of devices in the market as we speak and none of them offer a solution to one of the most important aspects of blood glucose testing. How can we make the pain associated with testing go away? And above everything else, why do we have to use a blood sample in order to get that reading? It is imperative we think about this for a second. One of the most difficult things to deal with is the pain. With the non-invasive glucose monitoring system, we're trying to avoid the hassle of getting your glucose levels tested, and yes, we're also going to remove the pain from it as well. This non-invasive glucose monitoring device system is set to revolutionize the diabetes world as we know it. The device is set to work in a very peculiar yet simple way. If we are to get scientific for a minute and bear with me, the system has been developed using a Wheatstone capacitor bridge that basically acts as a sensor. After endless data analysis, we have come up with this innovative piece of design. There are multiple capacitors on this sensor that are dedicated to be sending electromagnetic waves through the sensor itself and ultimately through the person's finger. The fine-tuning capacitors find the perfect balance between each other once a finger has been introduced in between the sensor plates. The capacitors achieve perfect sync thanks to the state-of-the-art microcontrollers to get the most accurate reading possible in a matter of seconds using the permittivity of water as a base reading or the dielectric of water to make it more simple, the monitor can correlate the glucose levels on a person by reading these results on the electromagnetic waves that are carrying. Yes, science at its finest. We have the ever-changing molecule of glucose composed of basic elements such as oxygen and hydrogen. We're aiming to measure the dielectric constant of this little puppy through capacitance level variations by sending electromagnetic waves across the finger in a matter of seconds. Do not worry, the waves are harmless. Such an intricate little box, we had to do some tinkering. To come up with the proper design, our engineers have spent countless hours running simulations and testing different designs to come up with the perfect dimensions for such little device that one day we can only hope will revolutionize the way we test blood glucose forever. We have thought about every single detail there is, we have taken into consideration different sizes of fingers, different types of skin and we have gone to the point to find out if it will actually fit in your pocket and if it will look fashionable after all. We have made sure that we have everything covered to make sure that the final product is something that we can definitely take pride in and above everything else that it will be something that you will definitely learn to love. <laughs>